Torres. Mahoney. This is Sebastian Anderson in a good position to cross it. Took a nick on the way through. Haji Berry, 2-1. You can't keep a good man down for long. Haji Berry's 24th goal of the season. Cameron Lancaster is within reach. He overcommitted on one of those plays because he had to. His backline defense really helped him out. Beckford in the middle and a goal for the switchbacks. Switchbacks take the lead late here, and it's Barry once again. Conversely, it has to be Guinzotti, but he's three for five this year. He's missed his last two penalties, including last game against Hartford. Guinzotti got it this time. 2-1 Rowdies on the road. 17th of the year, second most in the league to be entered in a contest to win VIP experiences at Dillon Stadium. Header forward, Rowdies can get their second and they do! And it's that familiar celebration, Guinzotti again! And he does get his first half brace. 2-0 Rowdies on the cusp of halftime. A lot of attacking players on the field that Danny Cruz is really pushing to, to get the win here in the second half. Joseph Martinez scores a PK. Jeff, tell me if you've heard that before. Yeah, a few times, a few times. At Atlanta United leading Inter-Miami with 12 plus stoppage to go. Headed down and in, Cameron Lancaster, and we're tied just like that. We were talking about it before the game. How many goals does he score with his head? That's three games in a row. Open out. Play it out to Gomez. Gomez into the box, headed away by Nile Lowe. Gomez again, header, and they score! Wow! Cameron Lancaster. Now Tosh to the right wing for Jimenez, back to Tosh. They like to possess the ball, try and confuse the defense a little bit. Memphis with a steal here. Pass ahead for Dakers, lead for Murphy, a long shot, he scores! And Memphis is on the board early! Number 15 on the season. Great challenge from Reynolds. Win, long ball ahead for Murphy. Too far. Oh. It's deflected off the keeper. For That's going in. And, it's in. <laughs> and Murphy will get credit for the goal. It's 14th of the year. Well, Memphis almost caught a break just moments ago on a potential own goal. And this time they catch a bit of a break and taking the lead here over in the, in the 11. Gotta say, Mike Stone probably not too displeased with the way his team have opened so far. Probably would prefer a few more scoring chances. This might be one here. Anderson is see with the win back. He finds Brett. Brett takes a shot. It's 1-1. One, one. It materialized quickly, and Nico Brett is off in dancing. Legion or level. Prosper Kasim, Bruno Lapa, who can find opportunities and score them themselves. This is a complete team. And we've seen Tampa Bay here recently. I think they're the, the class of the league. Nico Brett tries to chip it past Alec Cannon. He does, so Brett gets his brace on the night. Four for Birmingham here against Atlanta United, too. So Brett with goals 13 and 14 on the season with a little over a minute left. Quinn Herrera pops it up. Lambert. Quinn back to it. A short ball in. The shot through traffic, and it's gone in. Who else? Santi Moar has bagged surely the game winner in the 90th. Seeing this down. Moar puts this in. What a strike. Off the post, and Phoenix rising. Score first again, and Moar, he just can't stop scoring. So all the stats point to Pittsburgh creating the opportunities, making them, and eventually scoring from them. Perez. Perez rolls this in front and over the line, Cicerone. Was it Cicerone that got the last touch? Perez is certainly ecstatic. 
The crowd here too. It is 3-0 in the 75th. Five minutes of perennial vineyard stoppage time. Forbes sends this in. Caldwell got something on it. Cicerone. Cicerone scores! Of course it's Russell Cicerone! What a season it's been! And he might have just stolen three points!